uh, situation. The container vessel is a very important uh, the part of structure protecting the uh, nuclear reactor. And the uh, seawater is being injected right now. So it's not, I believe it's not a worst scenario. And now the uh, Nuclear Industrial Safety Agency is holding a news conference. As of 11.01, at the number three reactor in the number one nuclear power plant in Fukushima prefecture, uh, there was a loud sound and a white smoke bellowed out and there is a possibility that hydrogen explosion took place. And uh, this was uh, announced uh, by the Tokyo Electric Power Company. In terms of parameter, there is, uh, he, they believe that uh, the container vessel is not damaged. However, with regards to the radiation that might have leaked, they are now checking. And they have confirmed that some workers have been injured and they have called ambulance. And uh, in coordination with related agencies, the company says that it will try to secure safety and will continue uh, measuring, monitoring the situation. That was the report by the company. Now, uh, in addition to that, uh, what we would like to say is that uh, uh, that we accepted such report from the company. And currently, the wind, uh, actually on the ground, it is almost wind, wind, windless, but on, up uh, on the air, above, uh, it, the wind is blowing to the southwest. And also, for the residents who still remain in the 20 kilometers radius, we ask them to remain indoors, close the windows, and, and try not to be exposed to the air. Now, uh, there is a report that the worker who was injured was one, but according to the company, they say that uh, the worker has been in injured uh, without stating the number. So uh, that is not confirmed. So according to the company, they are now confirming that um, the worker has been injured. We don't know the figure. And that is the report that we received, and that is all from me. And also, uh, Chief Captain Secretary Yukio Edano had talked with the plant manager, and uh, he had made a report earlier to the people of Japan, and I don't think I should reiterate what he said, so that is all from me. Well, so the details are now being confirmed. But what is the rationale for you to say that the container vessel is safe and uh, undamaged? Well, uh, that is, can be concluded from the parameter. The parameter, according to the company's announcement, on the building, there is a monitoring being done and 20 micro seat belt of radiation per hour has been observed. And this 20 micro sievert per hour dose is uh, per hour. Now that is an amount that will not cause health damage. Uh, that is even 1 50th of the amount